The 10 Strangest Animals You'll Never Believe Are Real As far as I'm concerned, animals are the best. They're adorable, they make us laugh and cry, and they're just plain fun to look at. The world is full of amazing creatures that we'd be lost without. But what about some of the most interesting species on Earth? How can we know whether or not these animals actually exist for real? Well, let me tell you about 10 creatures that are so rare or strange that even scientists have trouble believing them. But before we begin our video, we would greatly appreciate it if you subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon. Irrawaddy Dolphin These are a unique group of dolphins that live in the Irrawaddy River in Burma. They are endangered and they are hunted for their meat and oil. The Irrawaddy dolphin has a long snout with thin lips, no beak, which makes it look like it's smiling at you when you're swimming next to it. These animals also have thicker skin than other dolphins do, so they can survive colder waters better than other types of marine mammals do. You may not know about these guys, but some people think that the Irrawaddy counts as a different species than other types just because they live in different places. But this isn't true at all. In fact, most scientists agree that there aren't any differences between these two groups at all. They're just one big family. Frill-necked lizard. These are Australian lizards that can grow to be up to 20 inches long. The frill around their neck is unique and serves as a defense mechanism against predators. These lizards are omnivores, meaning they eat both meat and plants, like fruits. Frill-necked lizards live in forests or open areas near water sources, such as streams, rivers, or lakes with plenty of food such as caterpillars or spiders. However, they also feed on small insects like beetles that live around trees during the daytime when they sleep at night. They also eat fruit like figs, but only if it has already been hollowed out by another animal first before eating inside its shell which means these animals don't seem like easy targets for predators either. Because frilled lizards are oviparous, they lay egg sacs. Females often lay one egg per clutch per year during the springtime months between December and March, depending on where you live and if there are any seasonal changes happening too. Blue Dragons They are a type of sea slug that lives in the Mediterranean Sea, off the coast of Spain. It's also commonly known as an Italia or Italian sea slug because these animals live in warm waters near Italy. The blue dragon has four pairs of arms on its tentacles and two pairs on its body, which makes it look like it has six arms. However, it actually only has four sets, one pair for each arm and another pair for each leg. The blue dragon can grow up to two inches long, but usually stays about one half inch long when they're swimming around at night when they're sleeping. Glaucus atlanticus. These are species of fish with a deep blue coloration and large fins. It can be found on the western coast of North America, including parts of California and Oregon. This animal has been known to grow up to 14 feet in length, with some reports saying that it is larger than any other fish species on Earth. This animal lives in shallow waters, where it feeds primarily on small crustaceans, called copepods, which are found in seawater masses near rocky beaches or coral reefs. While this might seem like an odd diet choice for such an impressive creature, and one we probably all prefer, there isn't any evidence that Glaucus atlanticus would be able to sustain itself without consuming these tiny insects since they're not usually found at depths of more than 100 meters below sea level. However, it should be noted that other types of crustaceans like krill may also serve as food sources for this particular ocean dweller. Cantor's Giant Soft-Shell Turtle The largest freshwater turtle in the world. It can live up to 100 years and can weigh up to 300 pounds. This species is found in China, Vietnam, and Laos. The Cantor's giant soft-shell turtle was first discovered by American zoologist John C. Merriam during his expedition to Hanoi, Vietnam, in 1908. The species was given its scientific name after Thomas Edward Cantor, who discovered it as well. Today, there are only around 1,500 left that have been protected by national parks around Laos, 
where they live on rivers or lakesides with other animals like fish or frogs. Star-nosed mole. This is a small mole found in eastern Canada and the northeastern United States. It has 22 pink fleshy tentacles on its nose, which it uses to feel its way around. The head of this animal has a prehensile tail that allows it to manipulate objects with ease. Star noses can dig up to 15 feet in one minute. The star-nosed mole lives in moist forested areas and is an omnivore. It eats worms, snails, and insects. The star-nosed mole has a very high metabolism rate and requires lots of food to fuel its digging activities. Its diet includes earthworms, millipedes, snails, and other invertebrates that live underground. Naked Mole Rat The naked mole rat, named for its distinct dark brown or black fur and lack of hair, is the only known eusocial mammal. In other words, it lives in colonies with sterile workers and fertile queen animals. They are blind, have poor eyesight, but excellent hearing, and are immune to cancer. The lifespan of a naked mole rat has been recorded at up to 32 years, the most extended recorded lifespan among mammals, which makes them ideal candidates for studying aging processes under controlled conditions. Jeronuk. This is a long-necked antelope found in Africa and Asia. It has a long neck and legs, which it uses to reach leaves and buds on trees. The Jeronek has a very specialized digestive system that allows it to eat only leaves that are rich in protein or fat. The Jeronek's large eyes help it see predators approaching from far away. However, if the animal is threatened by another predator or human interference with its natural habitat, it will flee at high speed, up to 50 miles per hour. Antelope Dick Dick. The Dick Dick is the smallest antelope in the world, and it can be found in Africa. It weighs about 2.5 kilograms and can run at up to 60 kilometers slash, which makes it fast for its size. However, its high speed comes at a cost. They're easily injured by rocks or spiky plants while running through dense forests. And if you hit one of them with your car, you might want to think twice before doing so. The Dick Dick's defining feature is its long legs that end in hooves instead of feet, like most other antelopes. These help it leap over obstacles without getting caught up on things like low branches or thick brush that would slow down other animals, more commonly seen in this region of Africa, like zebras. Their leaping ability also allows them to jump three meters high. Axolotl salamander. Axolotls are a type of salamander that can regenerate limbs they are critically endangered in the wild, with only about 2,500 remaining. The species was discovered by the Aztec people of Mexico and Guatemala thousands of years ago. Still, it has never been studied extensively by scientists because its presence is so rare. Axolotls live in lakes and rivers, but prefer to stay near bodies of water where they can absorb nutrients from algae or other plants, as well as catch prey. When an axolotl grows too large for its body size, about one foot long, it may leave its home environment if there aren't any suitable areas nearby. This is why they often appear at fish markets when they're ready to be sold as pets. So, that's it for today. We hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a comment below telling us what you thought about it. Also, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click the bell button to be notified of all our latest videos.